Brum, 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 Howdy, partner. Now, if you're wondering just what tarnation is going on here in our last video, our top comment was from Cream Monkey asking us to get the tier priceless while wearing a cowboy hat. So that's what I'm going to try to do because I don't want to stay on my head. And I don't know if I can keep the accent going this whole time. We've uh, reached episode three of our uh, renewed Road to Interstellar series, and it's about to get really weird. This is where all the, the weird suggestions start coming in. It's only gonna get worse from here. But on top of us getting the tier priceless, I'll also be getting all the other pistols priceless. In furthest tier, uh, we need to get, what, 25 kills while using a magnification scope? And this is a perfect opportunity to use the sniper version of the tier because we already got four kills for it. But shoot howdy, this should be an easy challenge because I'm pretty sure for the, the rest of our guns, we just need to get headshots and maybe akimbo shots. The accent's just gonna come and go. I, I already feel like I, I was losing it. Whenever I, like, I try to do an accent for too long, it's just gone. It goes away. I, I get too in my head about it. I just looked over at my webcam and this is ridiculous. I have this balancing over my headset because it don't like fit over top of it. The the hard part of the hat don't don't ban failure. I'll tell you what. So I'm 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 really trying to play without moving my goddamn dang old head. I went boomhauer. And I'm playing with like a the V-neck view. The the hat is now like starting to fall down over my eyes. I just have a, a big dark spot. I'm playing with glaucoma. I'm sure there's some remedies the doctor can figure out for me. Maybe some of that wacky tobacco. I, I, I had to say this is going to be easy. After I got those like initial kills, I don't think I've gotten one since. I'll tell you what. Now I'm only getting hit markers. Yeah, we're still at four kills. What's going on here? It must have poisoned the water hole. There we go. You know what this is reminding me of? It's reminding me of Toy Story where the shark goes into the toy box and he comes back up with Woody's hat and he goes, Hi, I'm Woody. Howdy, howdy, howdy. That's me right now. Okay, and we're finally getting kills. Let's go. Who else wants some? There we go. Almost got a clat there. This is weird. I feel like this pistol is doing enough to like get one shot kills and then other times it's just hit marker city. Very inconsistent pistol. But I feel like I didn't mention that we're going off of uh, top comment until like pretty late in, in our last multiplayer video. So uh, feel free to leave a comment of uh, what you guys want to see me do next and whatever dumb challenge. My hat is falling so far. This is ridiculous. It's uh, it's only downhill from here in terms of the challenges. This is this is pretty tame from all the other stuff we've done. If you guys watched our uh, Road to Dark Aether number three, Revenge of Peck, some of those challenges there were just absolutely absurd. You guys have me playing Wii Sports. But you know what? When we're doing dumb stuff like this, this is when I'm having the most fun. It adds a whole nother layer to the stupidity of these grinds. Because if I'm already going to be struggling with the camo challenges, I might as well... Uh, you're doing something stupid. Give me an excuse to be bad. Because we're still fighting to try to get our, our KD positive. I think we're like 40 deaths above our kills. And I don't know if the tier is going to be helping with that. But we can try, failure. Tell you what. I got like two two phrases. You pull my string on my back and that's what I'll say. I got a dick in my chute. Or whatever what he says. Snake in my boot. Oof. We got to be close, right? Actually, I, I would doubt if we're close. Oh, wait, 22 kills? Three more. All right, we got this. Let's uh, try to get this done in this game, though. I don't want to be working on this multiple games. If we can get a pistol done a game, we're, we're smooth sailing. yippee ki -yay, motherfucker. It's high noon. Das house ain't big enough for the 6v6 of us. Giddy up. What other things do Cowboys say? We're going to win the Super Bowl this year. Okay. We're the best team in the NFL. Dak Prescott's the best QB there ever was. Jerry Jones is a genius. Ezekiel Elliott playing center. Now, who would have thought of that? That's daggone impressive. Oh, and there's 25 operator kills aiming down sights and our priceless camo. So I can ditch the cowboy act and we can move on to our core 45. No more broke back mountain for me. I was getting sore. So what we gotta do for this? 25 headshots. Which one's the core? Oh, no, wait. Yeah, 10 headshots, actually. Not bad. Let's see if we can do it. I just gotta make sure my aim is on point. That was not. That was slightly. A little bit better. Oh, come on. I keep hitting, like, throat shots. These guys are getting throated. I don't know how that wasn't a headshot, though. Where else could I hit them? I'm handing out tracheotomies. 
I'm once again asking for head. I just need a little bit of top. A slight amount. Don't try to move around on me. Stop moving. I saw that guy, like, assess the situation, see that I was ass, and then try to, like, do some movement god shit on me. Like, this was, like, OG war zone. Okay. I'm just gonna have to stab you. That was hit a shot challenge level expert. And we missed every note. If we can somehow get this challenge done, as well as the tiers, getting two weapons done in the same game, that wouldn't be bad. We'd be on a nice little streak here. We'd be very efficient. This is like the opposite of the snipers. The snipers took me like multiple games to get done for each. There we go. Only took me trying to decide which guy I wanted to kill. I am getting slaughtered. I have 41 kills this game too, and I know I got more deaths. I've gotten one UAV total. So I've streaked a total of one time. Ooh, we got that though. A little hip fire heady. Getting head from the hip. We can't be far off though. We just need three more. And there's 30 seconds left of the game, depending on whether or not we capture this hard point. Somebody needs to stay on it. There we go. Come on, two more. One more. Oh, don't you hit me camo curse. Let me get this. Oh, there we go. Ooh, Priceless popped up fast on that one. Wasted no time. What do we got to do next? Renetti. Also headshots. 25 headshots with the Renetti. Up in the ante. How do they pick the amount of kills that you're going to have to do for each weapon? Because it seems so off. Some weapons you got to do a lot. Other weapons, you use it for like one life and you're done. There we go. We're at least getting out of here with a little bit of progress on the Renetti. And by a little bit, I mean like the smallest amount possible. There we go. Finishing the game with a headshot. And we moved up to about halfway on the leaderboard. Still not excited to see how many deaths I have. Yikes. 63. Most in the game. Oh, wait, no. Second most. I'm not even the best at dying. I am the best at getting two pistols priceless in that game. No one else can say that. Arcady's still at one somehow. I'm oh, 32 deaths behind. We can make that up. We just need to go on a quick 32 kill streak. And this is a very underrated camo for the Renetti that I feel like doesn't get talked about enough. I unlocked this like way early into the game, but this being my channel colors and it being able to glow in the dark, pretty sick. I like how they're adding in a lot of camos that glow in the dark. I feel like they haven't really utilized that. Homelander, no. That's what you get, Homelander. Why don't the boys just try doing that? show would be over lickety split Ooh, we're getting better with the headshots let's uh, get better at staying alive though maybe that's something we can do well, let's let's focus on that this game let's focus on having a, a nice kd starting now we can multitask we can have a nice kd and get our camos done it seems like the renetti's got a bit more range than our core 45 did the range insane a whole lot here on shipment homelander if a soup still has to use the tomfa we're fucked you better be getting camos for that. If you're using it for leisure, you're psychotic. I've seen enough of the Tomfa trying to get that uh, Black Ops blueprint. I played Warzone for a bit and it was actually pretty fun. Yeah, it was fun getting back into Warzone. They, they kind of forced me to do it to try to get that blueprint. I had to play a lot of games. But outside of uh, like randomly going to a building and someone was sitting there with a Tomfa, I had a pretty good time. And I would like to make some Warzone content, but I don't know what to do in there because there ain't no way... I'm getting a nuke. You guys see me in multiplayer. You think it's any better in Warzone? Hell no. I don't know. Like, you guys are down for some streams or something? No, hit my line. Oh, look at that. We actually have a UAV. We'll call it in. Let's get a UAV count for this this recording. We got two. Count them. Two. And that's game. I don't know about the whole KD thing. Let's, uh, let's, that was a warm up. We're not counting that one. We got close though. 0.69 KD. Actually, I meant to do that. That was on purpose. Oh no. I feel like Rust is going to be terrible for trying to get kills with this pistol. It is a small map, but there's a lot of long range angles. We'll just have to adapt. Simply be better. Oh fuck. Oh, uh, we're getting some kills. Like a very small amount, but they're not headshots. I'm somehow at the top of the leaderboard here. I must have gotten more confirms than everybody else. Because I am getting my shit clapped. My room's starting to stink. They're clapping me so hard. That's that's horse shit right there. That was ping. That was lag. Uh, that guy's obviously hacking and has Cronus. There's really nothing I could do. Oh, throw aim assist in there as well. Dude. Please. One one crumb of head. Just a, a smidgen. It's like a small pigeon is what smidgen means. At this point, I'm just going to stop telling you guys if I go negative. It should just be assumed.
I'll just only let you know if I go positive. I folded. We're in hardcore. It's got to be easier to get headshots this way. I don't think it can be harder. Actually, this is a burst pistol, so one of the shots could land anywhere else. I oh, know we're good. Oof. All headies. And look at that. UAV number three plus a counter UAV moving up in the world. I, I was made for hardcore. Oof. I'm the best hardcore player this world's ever seen. And there's Priceless. Just like that. All you need is a little bit of hardcore. And now we need to get a Kimbo kills, which should be stupidly easy. Unless these things just suck. Which I feel like they might, because I was already getting hit markers here on hardcore. Don't you turn around. There we go. I was so focused on trying to kill that guy and him not seeing me while I reloaded. My brain completely short-circuited. No way this guy's name is Diddy's Playhouse. That's fucked up. It's the Diddy House. Playhouse. Come inside. There is crimes inside. That's probably about as PG as I can make that. <gasps> and we went positive. Very positive, actually. Hardcore is our home. This is our, the way we climb ourselves out of our, our hole. Oh, I have to kill enemies affected by our tactical while using a Kimbo? No wonder we got no progress that game. All right. We, we had a nice little warm-up game, a little ego boost game. Now we can get to the meat and potatoes. I'm just throwing flashes wherever I go until I run out of them. It's awesome that I only get two of those per life unless I throw on restock or until my munition box is ready to go. So I'm very limited on the amount of uh, camo progress I can get here. But at least uh, I can boost my KD a bit. And that's another UAV added to the count. We're actually getting so many, we're, we're losing count. I'm just too nasty. I'm the greatest at shooting people first. That's all you need for hardcore, baby. I wonder if uh, gas grenades would be better. I feel like they can be affected by gas grenades longer than a stun would. Or maybe spotter grenades? I just saw somebody use that. I feel like that lasts for a little bit. Let's try it. The snapshots. Oh, come on. That was a, a nice double we could have had right there. His own teammate took the kill for me. I wonder if that counted, because I think it wore off by the time I killed him. Let's see. Nope. Oof. Definitely got one there. Maybe one there? What? Did it not count? Oh, maybe... Damn it. Those don't work, apparently. All right, let's try tear gas. Ooh. Maybe that counted? I also got a teammate in the crossfire there. And another UAV. That's how we measure our skill here. I don't think the tear gas is helping either. I, I for sure got a kill while somebody was in it. Okay. Going back to the stuns. This challenge is a pain in the ass. It's taking forever. There we go. That had to be one. We're at five now. Okay, we're starting to get into a groove. Oh, hit a fucking shot, dude. Maybe that counted? Perhaps? If not, I'll take a five times. This sucks. Now that- Oh, never mind. I was gonna say, now that I'm doing well, teammate unfortunately had to be part of that, that I'm more incentivized just to die so I can get my stuns back. We got an advanced UAV. That's like the biggest UAV there is. Ooh. Keep it coming. Oh, what a nice little streak. This is our KD saving game. How close are we? 18 out of 25? Okay. We're getting a little bit, a small amount. It's definitely taking a bit, but we're doing it. Ooh. I don't know if it's happening in this game, but we're doing pretty decent. We're getting some things done. Oh, if I could have got that next kill. Oh, we would have been real close. 22 out of 25. And we went positive again. Hardcore is just where I need to be. I'm sick of this challenge. Let's get it over with. It ends this game right here and right now. I don't know why COD ever thought it would be a good idea to like have a perk where it automatically spots or pings enemies whenever you aim in at them. It is the most annoying perk you can have. On paper, I get it. You know, it's it's all right. It's cool. You can ping an enemy and then your team knows where they are. You know, something like in search and destroy could be good. You know, Warzone, I, I feel like it would be nice, but Warzone and multiplayer don't have the same perks. But in multiplayer, that shit is annoying. Like, it's like when your teammate goes down in Warzone and they sit there and they spam ping whoever knocked them. 
thinking that them spamming it will get them killed faster. Like, we don't need this amount of UI in a hardcore. This is ridiculous. Oh, but we got priceless. So you know what? I'm fine with it. We'll take it. Let's uh, just try to get our KD up this game. We'll, we'll spend the rest of this game just trying to do as best as we can. But I don't know how well that's going to go because uh, my SPMM must have gone up. Me actually having positive KD games, the, the, the COD gods are trying to change that. They do not like it when I go positive. I'm starting to feel like we might do ourselves a favor if we stop playing this game. I'm over here trying to get my KD up and I feel like I'm just making it worse. Yeah, let's leave. We, we got our camo. We're done. Did we at least tighten the gap? Uh, not really. I felt like I was doing better. We we're definitely doing better those last few games, but we need a lot more of those. At least now we have 15 out of 36 weapons priceless that we need to get to Interstellar. So we're making progress. We're almost halfway there. I think that about does it for today. Make sure you guys leave a comment down below of what weapon you want to see me do next and whatever challenges you guys have for me. But I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Thank you guys for watching. I truly appreciate all your love and support, and I will see you in the next one. Later.